In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where set automatically is grayed out on the date and time. So I'm going to be showing you this on an iPad, but this will also work on an iPhone as well. So if you're on the date and time settings window on your Apple device and the set automatically button here is grayed out and it doesn't let you click it, then there's actually a couple of things we can do to solve this issue. Now, first thing is you just want to come over to the main settings page on your iPad. And from here, we're going to scroll all the way down on the left and select privacy and security. Now click on location services and make sure location services is turned off and disabled and then just go and press turn off. Once you've done that, we're gonna come back over to the left hand navigation and this time click on screen time. And you need to check to see if you have a button here to turn off the screen time. So I'm not gonna have this option as I don't have screen time enabled, but if you do see a button here that says turn off screen time, then just go ahead and click that to turn it off. Once you've done that, we're gonna click on content and privacy restrictions and you also want to make sure this option here is turned off and disabled. And once you've done that, you can then come back over to general in the left hand side, scroll all the way down and select date and time. And now you should be able to go and click on the set automatically button. And then you should be able to change your date and time manually. And it's really as simple as that, guys. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you with the next.